you know, folks, back again. Um, just a quick video because we were doing something tonight that reminded me of something I said a while back. Um, it was in one of the older videos and it was about why you'd attack someone's guard. So where they're defending or where they're most strong, why would you actually attack it? There's a few reasons. We start with, uh, as you all know, we like ourselves, to George, George Silver. So George Silver does a guard called Shoe Garden. It's a very strong guard. It's strong and it's good because it keeps the point back. It's protecting this side, the head and body. There's lots of reasons why I do it. It's good. So if I'm facing someone, and they're in that guard too, why would I attack there knowing that they can defend it? The, so, the first reason is, well, it's always about suppression. I'm attacking the guard, I'm attacking where they're strongest because I want to keep them there. Either I want to keep them there or I want to elicit a reaction. Firstly, I want to keep them, keep them there. So I'm attacking that, no one has to defend it. But the point being, I'm coming close so I can follow through. So I'm not being nice and gentle, I'm being... Whatever, okay. Point being, I want to grapple him. He's strong, he's good. I can't outfence him, but what I can do is just be really stupid and attack him. He thinks, I'll, I'll defend this. And if I do nothing, he's going to come round and hit, and hit me because he's taking all the power out. But the point being, it's suppression. Okay, stop using silver. <laughs> there are obviously counters this very easily. But the point being, okay, or I might just want to come through and so on. The point being, I'm suppressing them because I want to close. The other thing is, my attack's good, my hits are strong. Now, works with two-handed sword better, we'll try it in a minute. But the point being, if his guard's up there, I won't go too mad, but the point being, I can power through that. And as I do, okay, there's nothing, no matter how strong he tries to keep that, he will hit himself. I think why I do that, it's not going to do an awful lot of damage. Again, it's, su it's suppression, it's making them second guess themselves. If we're in a competition, does hitting yourself count as a point? Probably. <laughs> but the point being, I'm using power. That has hit himself and he can't stop it, no matter what he does. And the point being, I've taken that for the split second it needs to finish through. Again, sub suppression to keep him, to keep him there. Now, if we do it with long sword, Now again, I'm not saying you should always do this, because if the guy is good, even if we're in some form of normal, listen, if I try and power through, all he'll do is avoid it and stab me in the face. Okay, no, but the point being, is it might be, I might be trying it, and he raises to stop, to stop, stop me. And I realise he's, do, he's, do, do, he's do, doing it, so the next thing get I power through. Now, I can stay there and we can start the, the noble war or Krieg or whatever, but the point being, I can just keep going. One or two things, either it'll collapse and I'll get through, or I'll get close enough when all this happens. Point being, I'm, again, it's like the modern equivalent of suppressive fire. I'm keeping them there. Now, if he's clever, he'll do something about it. So I said, you've got to judge it whether you can use it. The other one, again, as I said, is about using it as a way as a way in. If he's less experienced, if we're in a normal fight position, I can come through. It's just simply just a smash through again suppression and he can he can block that because he's really strong blocks it but we've now got edge on edge and you do, I can feel where I want to be whether I want to do that whether I want to come off etc etc et I have done I have won uh, wasn't a human competition weird enough it was against Jap Japanese swords so, so, swords teacher and I was throwing the odd just what I call number one cut in just to see what he'd do and he kept blocking it. And again, I remember the whole physics thing. Is what you practice this with sticks, I'll show you in a minute. If you keep hitting the same area, and if you do it right, the hits start to get harder and harder. And it was just basically just did one, two, on the third one, it collapsed and it hit his head. Because again, I kept them there and I kept moving it through. There are a couple of reasons why you might want to attack their strong position. You can use it as a way of closing, 
You can use it as a way of destroying them, or you can use it to elicit a response. Get to that in a minute. Get back to the single hander. What you find with a lot of single hander, especially basket hilts and so, so on, what sometimes happens is a pattern appears. So I attack that, and then this, and then that. And that, happens, that can happen a couple, couple of times. Now, if I know that's what's going to happen, I can make that happen. So he comes in, knowing he's going to come round. Because he thinks we're going to play this game. Bang. And he does it again. Bang. And out. But again, it's about suppression and it's about controlling, controlling the fight. That's just some ideas why you attack, why you attack the, the, the guard. The caveat is, it can always go wrong. You can get it wrong. As I said, a very good fighter, I could be trying to power through and they just very easily avoid it and smack me on the head. But have a play, have a play with it. But more, what's a really good one is if you get a stick, which is this, get someone to hold the stick and practice what you call suppressive hits. So it comes in, I'm like, come on. Keep going. Yay! And again, it's harder with a single hander, but you can do it. No, I can stick it. No. <laughs> Hold it here. <laughs> <laughs> but again, start with your knee press. Again, control on this, so if he moves the stick, you've got control of not doing this. Again, we, get, we, we always say it's not about power and strength. It isn't, but it can be about power if you control it. Thanks very much.